my channel. My name is Natalie and I'm the owner of Poised and Prepped and I sell pre-loved clothing for men, women, and children. And today I am back out at my local Goodwill store to do a little bit of sourcing. It is pouring rain outside right now and there's like 45 minutes until they close, but I'm going to run in here. I'm hoping I can come out with like five to 10 items. So let's run in here and see what I can find. I never felt tomorrow closing in this fast Oh, I guess time's in a rush Leaves are falling down But at least they grow back While I'm on a one-way track Now I everything ready to show you what I ended up picking up today now like I said before I did not have a lot of time the store was closing in like 45 minutes so this was like a really rushed sourcing trip but I'm still really happy with everything that I ended up finding so let's jump right in to the haul all right so this first is a tweed blazer this one is by Ann Taylor and there's the tag this one is a size too petite and i love picking up these like ann taylor tweed blazers i really love picking up a lot of tweed blazers just in general especially like j crew and brands like that um tweed blazers perform so well for me that when i see them i almost don't even run comps anymore just because i know that they're going to get a lot of attention and a lot of interest i love picking up tweed blazers this one is really pretty. I love this like green and blue like blend. Such a nice blazer. I will probably list this one somewhere around like $45 to $50. And I paid $5.49 for this one. So pretty good profit margins. I, I will probably get like maybe $40 to $45 for it. So again, I love picking these up. These usually perform pretty well and sell pretty quick. So Really nice find there. This next piece is by Soft Surroundings. This is a size petite small, and this one is a maxi length. And I love all the patterns and like bright colors. This is a really pretty dress by them. Um, it is short sleeves. I don't know, I just really loved the print on this one. And in terms of Soft Surroundings, Soft Surroundings is a great brand to resell. It does pretty well in the secondhand market. I find um, personally that I usually like to hold out for like a lot of their coats or like sweaters do pretty well for me and then like maxi dresses. I've tried to sell like pants by Soft Surroundings, um, just like other sort of like more basic style tops and I didn't really have as much success in terms of those items. So I usually just try to stick to again maxi dresses, sweaters, coats. I guess you would say just more like substantial pieces by them. But I ended up paying $6.49 for this dress and I couldn't find this exact dress, but dresses similar in, you know, style were comping for around $40 to $50. So that's pretty great. I mean, I'm really happy with that. And I think this is a really nice piece. It is in excellent condition, absolutely flawless. It doesn't even look like it's been like washed yet. I mean, it's, it's in really great condition. So really happy to find this dress. I also found a second dress by Soft Surroundings. And this is what the tag looks like on this one. This one is a size petite medium. This one is just like a sleeveless midi-length coral dress. 
really, really pretty. It sort of has like this pleated look to it, but it's just really simple and classy looking. I paid $6.49 for this one as well. And again, comps on these kind of dresses, midi to maxi length, um, go for around $40 to $50. But I will say there are some dresses by Soft Surroundings that I have seen that are not new with tags or anything that go for like even $80 to $90. So when it comes to Soft Surroundings, if I come across, again, maxi midi length dresses, I definitely like to stop, look the piece over, run comps, um, because I have seen some of their dresses sell for $80 to $90. So definitely a brand I am always on the lookout for. Let's see. Okay, this one is really cute. This one was Gap. And here's the tag. Gap size 8 tall. This one is new with tags. And it's blue, floral print. It's midi length. It is like a wrap style dress. It's got these really pretty like buttons that sort of like go down the side. Really pretty dress. I did run comps on this one because you know, it, you know, with Gap, you know, with a lot of mall brands, I definitely take time to run comps on. Some of the pieces can do really, really well. Others can just be duds. Um, the stock photos of this dress were really pretty and comps on this dress were really good actually. I saw some of these selling new with tags between like $35 to $40. So especially being a size eight, new with tags, the style being midi length, floral, I just thought it was a really pretty piece. I thought it would do pretty well. So I did go ahead and pick this one up. Again, I paid $6.49 for this one and I'll probably list it about $35 to $40. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Please hit that like and subscribe button and turn on the bell so that you receive a notification every time I upload a brand new video. Standing underneath the lights. I also found these red Jeffrey Campbell heels. I was so excited when I found these. This is what the inside looks like right there. It says Jeffrey Campbell. Um, they do have a little bit of wear on the bottoms, but really not that bad. Here it says 148 is the retail price. I love finding Jeffrey Campbell. The last pair that I found, I listed them and they sold for like full price within like the first one to two weeks of listing them. And I just remember being so ecstatic. So when I saw these, I was really excited. I'm hoping I have the same success with this pair. These do have like a little bit of like wear on like the heels here you can see i may try to like clean these up a bit i'm really not one for like cleaning shoes i'm not really good at that but these are really nice i was really really happy to find these i think the style of these is really great um comps on these were around like 40 to 50 dollars so i paid 5.99 for them i'll probably list them again probably like 50 in hopes that i can get 40 out of them and hopefully if I can get, like I said, some of those like places off, I think I can definitely get the full 40. So very happy with that find. This next shirt is by Rails. This one's a size small. This is sort of like, has more of like a military, like cargo style to it. It has these like pink embroidered flowers on both of the sleeves. And I did run comps on this one. Comps were selling on this one around like $40 to $50, which is really great. I paid $4.99 for this one. So definitely a great find. I love finding rails. I really don't find it as often as I wish I could, but when I do find it in good condition, I almost always pick it up. This next item is a top by J. Crew. This top is so beautiful in person. I love the sleeves and this beautiful like floral lace detail. It is so pretty. And then the other reason I wanted to pick it up is that when I look inside underneath the care tag, it shows that this item is from spring 2020. So that tells me it's a newer item by J. Crew. And after, you know, looking up comps, the stock photo of this top is absolutely gorgeous. Um, tops that are in good condition that aren't new with tags are selling for around like $40, which for a top, I feel like that's really good. So I definitely wanted to go ahead and pick this one up. I paid $4.99 for this. 
Definitely this is more of like a higher quality top by J. Crew. So, so pretty. I was so excited when I found this one. I also picked up this dress. This one is by Calvin Klein. It's a size 14 and it's just a really nice, classy looking dress. This one is denim and it zips down the front. It has these nice like zipper pockets. It's sleeveless, it's collared. I definitely felt like this was more of like a career wear piece, something that, you know, you could wear to work. Really, really nice. And I also picked it up because it still has the little like bag inside with extra buttons. So that tells me this has not been washed. It's probably pretty much brand new. It definitely looks to be in brand new condition. So again, I do like to pick up Calvin Klein. Um, if it meets, you know, just certain requirements. Like I like that this one's a size 14. I like the style of this piece. I just think that a piece like this will do pretty well. Um, I paid $6.49 for this one and I'm probably gonna list this one around like $40. So I love picking up Calvin Klein. Calvin Klein does well for me. So very happy to find that. I also picked up this J. Crew men's quilted vest. And this one's a size extra small. And the main reason that I wanted to pick this vest up is this right here. I'm gonna show you this tag. It says Thermore. And this is basically thermal insulation. And a lot of these J. Crew outerwear pieces have this like additional insulation built into them. And it's really high quality. And a lot of people love finding this. So when I saw this, had it in there, I definitely wanted to pick it up. I paid $4.99 for this, and comps on this vest were $45. So pretty great. I definitely wanted to grab it. I think it's a great piece, especially as we head into fall and winter. So definitely happy to find that. I also picked up this blue mountain hardware vest. This one is women's, there's the tag, it's a size large. And I really, really loved this vest, it's in excellent condition. I did run comps on this one and recently it had sold for around $30. So I paid $4.99 for it. Again, it's in excellent condition, it's a size large, which is a really great size. So I decided to go ahead and pick it up. Again, just since we're in fall and winter and I know a lot of people like to layer with these vests, so I really wanted to try and get some outerwear into my closet. Very happy to find these. This next piece is by Eileen Fisher. This is a wrap and it is beautiful. It is in excellent condition, perfect. It doesn't have a size on it and it also doesn't have a care tag either so I'm really not sure I'm guessing it's more of like a one size fits all type of a wrap I did try to look up comps on this one and I could not find this exact one but other wraps by Eileen Fisher were selling for around 65 to 75 dollars and this one is beautiful again excellent condition this really pretty like nude pink tone it's gorgeous so I paid $4.99 for it. I'm probably gonna list it for around 65 to 70. Absolutely beautiful. I was so excited to find this. The last thing I thrifted today was actually this set of dishes. These have these beautiful woodland birds on them. Oh my goodness. When I saw these dishes, I was so excited. And these have like different birds on all the plates. They're gorgeous. So I actually collect Spode, which also does a variation of plates like this with these like woodland creatures on them. So when I saw these, I was so excited. I was like, I have to pick these up. These are by Lightwood and Sun. And it says they're made in England and they are just absolutely beautiful. So I got all four of these plates for $3.99. And I don't know, I just think these are perfect for like Thanksgiving and like the fall. I was so excited to find these. So that is everything I found today. I hope you all enjoyed this haul. Please hit that like and subscribe button and I will see all of you again soon. Bye everybody. Standing underneath the lights Look into each other's eyes